What does a pomegranate, Solomon's temple, and a half a million dollars have in common? Let's dive in. In the ancient world, pomegranates were highly sought after and was a sign of fertility and plenty in the land. It was used in wine, served for drinks, and eaten right off the tree. We also find it among ancient relics and temples, specifically Solomon's temple. The temple had two pillars named Boaz and Yakin, which means in his strength he will establish. These pillars are adorned with pomegranates, which brings us to our story. See, a few decades ago, an ivory pomegranate was discovered. The ivory pomegranate is a thumb-sized Jewish ornamental artifact. It is not actually made of ivory, but of hippopotamus bone. And you guessed it, it was dated to the time period of Solomon's Temple. It was discovered in 1979 when French paleographer André Lamar visited the shop of an old city antiquities dealer in Jerusalem, who invited Lamar to return another day to see a small inscribed ivory object. Reportedly over a cup of tea, the dealer showed Lamar the tiny pomegranate. Lamar photographed the ivory and published it two years later in the Revue Biblique. Then, in 1984, the revered magazine Biblical Archaeology Review published Lamar's articles, instantly attracting worldwide attention. Three years after that, the pomegranate was offered to the Israel Museum for $600,000 by a tour guide intermediary. The story has it that it was originally purchased for $3,000 by a Jerusalem antiquities dealer. Now the price tag was $600,000, and at the same time, the offer was made, it was being smuggled out of Israel and it found its way to an exhibit in the Grand Palais in Paris. The next year, the Israel Museum raised enough money to purchase it for $550,000, where it remains to this day. What makes this pomegranate special is the Paleo-Hebrew inscription it bears, Holy to the Priest of the House of Yahweh. It was thought to have adorned the High Priest's scepter within the Holy of Holies. This finding provides contrary evidence to the nihilist school of biblical scholarship that would claim all events described in the Bible before the Babylonian exile are fictional.